Hey guys and welcome back to the channel my name is Jason and today we're going to be taking a sidestep away from Project Dale and I want to give you what in my opinion are the top five things that you're going to need to grow your automotive YouTube channel in 2020. So in this video are going to be my top five things that I think you need to know on how to grow your automotive YouTube channel in 2020. The first thing that we're going to talk about is setting goals. So if you follow my channel at all, you will know that in the last video, I set a goal for my channel of 5,000 subscribers by the end of 2020 and 500,000 views to this channel. One of the things that you need to do to move forward is to have goals to reach because if you've got nothing to measure, you're never going to gain. Now the second thing I think that you're going to need to grow your channel in 2020 is collaborations. Collaborations between two or more channels draws in a viewership of multiple people from different areas. This guy's viewers may come over to your channel, your viewers may go over to his or her channel. It's all about reaching out and setting goals on who you want to collab with. So some of the people that I collaborated with in 2019, Send It Steve, Hammerdown Motorsports, Diablo Formula Racing, Matt MPG, and of course, America Bumper to Bumper and Street Six Fan, who I do my live feed with on Thursday evenings. Reaching out in 2020 and setting new goals on who you want to collaborate with is going to be what will make or break your channel. This year, I'm inclined to reach out to Robbie at United By Trucks as well as Dylan McCool. If you can't set a goal, you're certainly not going to chase it. You've got to have something that's going to create a following to your channel. Whether it's your personality, your sense of humor, whether it be dark or funny, or a specific project vehicle that's going to draw some attention. As you guys know, I have three projects. I'm going to flash them up on the screen. We've got Project Dale, which I recently acquired that we're working on now. I've got my 1979 Chrysler Cordoba, as well as my 04 Mercury Grand Marquis we call Grandma. Not to mention my daily driver, the Grey Goose, which is my 2000 Volkswagen Passat wagon. Finding yourself a project vehicle does not have to be expensive. If there's a car out there, I guarantee you, there's a following. Another thing that you can associate with your channel to help grow things is shock value. All of you guys have seen this video where I took my 2009 Kia Sportage we call Bubbles, loaded it with 12 pounds of Tannerite and lit that thing up. Blowing Bubbles is one of my fastest growing viewed videos on my channel right now. But most of all, you have to be you. You can't change who you are in front of the camera or behind the camera. People are going to see right through that once you start making some videos. So just act natural. Be you. Also, be dedicated. If you're going to start a YouTube channel, make sure you're committed to uploading on a schedule. Because if you don't, you're going to get a few followers here and there, but they may not come back because they don't know where and or when to find you. And last, but certainly not least, be consistent. If you're going to create a YouTube channel and have a following, they're going to want to know when you're uploading your videos. So whether you're doing it once a month, once a week, three times a week, make sure your audience knows that and do your best to stick to a schedule. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this little journey through the five things I think you're going to need to help grow your automotive YouTube channel. It's the practices that I've been following that's been growing my subscribers on a daily basis. But then again, I'm just a new channel. So if you don't want to take my word for it, go over and check out Creator Fundamentals and or Pusa Studios. And each of those guys will have their links in the description box below. And you can go over and follow them and learn the rules to being a YouTube channel, no matter what genre you've chosen. My name is Jason. My channel is Old Car Auto Guy. Thanks for watching. And I hope that you can follow in everything that I'm doing on my channel. Stay focused on the windshield, not the rearview mirror. I love you guys. God bless. We'll see you in the next project video.